Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Janae. I run a blog called High Low Lux, and I love luxury beauty, fashion, and travel. And we finally have our Zara haul. I know it took a while for everything to come in, but now it's here. So I'm gonna try everything on, style it up, talk you through what I like, what I don't like. We're not gonna ramble too much. We're gonna get right into the video. Okay, so first up is this stunning top, which you know I was super excited about. If you saw my vlog where we online shopped and picked out all of these pieces, I did go back and add a few more. But I love this. <laughs> You can't tell i love this um it was 39.90 for the quality i feel like that is a really good deal i got a size medium fits great there's still like plenty of room in the bust if your boobs are bigger than mine um i did tuck mine under so you can kind of see like it has this little ruching and it's just all elasticated so i could probably go down a size in this too so if it's like limited stock you could size probably down or up it's pretty roomy but it also hugs your body with like the elastic pieces and again I tucked mine under so if you have a longer torso or your collar this would work for you just fine and then if you have a shorter one you can just do what I did I've had this shirt on for a while um, kind of tucked under like that and it stayed just fine so um, and I could probably even tuck it under more if I wanted like more of a crop top depending on like the bottoms I had on so love 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 this top so I paired it with these shorts these are old from Zara, a few years old, but they always have something like it. My tip is to always size up. That's how they kind of get loose around the thighs so they don't look like they're short, but they don't look too risque. I think I got these in like a 29 or a 30 and I'm typically a 27, 28. So that's how they fit the way they do. This is the first item. Let's move on to the next thing. Okay, next up is this skirt, which is stunning. You know, we were going between this skirt and like the romper that was polka dot. It, that was like half the price um, but I went with the skirt and it was worth it it was worth every penny so far so good um, this was $69.99 so pretty pricey for Zara um, but again they came through with the quality this feels kind of reminds me of like something from rotate that's what this reminds me of really good quality really great detail work um, the ruffles just like stand up on their own and I didn't have to like um, steam it or iron it or anything it just came out of the box Looking this great, I did size up, which was suggested by the website. Um, so I got a large and it is a little too big, but I would prefer <laughs> that as I get smaller, I can just get it taken in as opposed to like being super tight and uncomfortable. Like I can kind of take it in at my leisure. So, um, so just FYI, but I think this is stunning. Again, like the waist could be a lot tighter. Like that's how I would prefer it to be. Kind of see the difference but i would rather get that taken in on my own so i'm going to take it to the tailor when they open and have them just take it in a little bit in the waist because it does fit fine around my hips comfortably but if you have more of a curvy shape i would suggest still sizing up and then maybe just getting it a little altered so but i think this is stunning and this is kind of how i would wear it because it's so girly and so flirty i would want to dress it down a little bit and just make it a little cooler so that's why i paired it with um this t-shirt this is a christian dior t-shirt obviously any t-shirt will do and then depending on where you're going like i could put on those little sneakers with this and just like wear it for a cute lunch date but then i could also wear heels and you know wear it out but okay next up is this patchwork denim skirt super cute um i got this in a medium and it was 39.99 the quality is not the best, just FYI, but as a mini skirt lover, like that's one of my favorite things to wear in the summertime, I'm happy I'm gonna keep it, um, but it's not like a super thick denim and it does run, I would say a little small. I got a medium and it was a, a bit of a struggle to like pull up over my hips because the zipper, um, it has a zipper that goes like this far and there's not really any stretch in it, so it is kind of um, like rigid. So it was hard to get on, um, but once I got it on, like I have room in the waist, but it's like just right. But I'm gonna keep it because I think it looks super cute and it's just a different take, another option for a denim skirt. I wear the denim skirt that I have a lot in the summer, so I wanted another option, so I don't like wear that one to death. Um, yeah, that's that's <laughs> that's pretty much it. Um, worth the worth the price point. It's 39 bucks. And I think the other denim skirt I have that I love and I've had for years was like 150. It's from uh, Girlfriend Denim and it's a really good brand and you know that will last me a long time. So it to me it's worth that price point. 
and I think this one is worth this price point. So that's that. Moving on. Okay, next up is this cute little combo. It's like a tank top and a matching cardigan in this really pretty, I would have to say like fuchsia -y pink, which is one of my favorite colors. And I love it. This is definitely <laughs> a keep. I got them both in a medium. And I feel like I, maybe I wish I would've got this in a large just so it was a little more hangy, like loungy, I don't know. But I also kind of really like the way it looks. Um, this is, I feel like, longer for a crop top. As you can see, there's nothing really cropped here. So I'm probably going to cut mine. That's just how I roll. Um, this was $25 and this was $39. So, I mean, kind of pricey for the combo, but I feel like they make a really nice impact. They're pretty comfy, really like good quality material. Um, really pretty like button details, kind of got these crystals. Um, so I feel like it's pretty much worth the price point, but I would prefer if it was like this length. Again, I'm short, I'm only 5'4", five, 5'3 five, and a half. So um, if you're taller or have a longer torso, it's probably a perfect crop. But for me, it's not a crop at all. <laughs> so I'm probably going to, like, I just feel like that's more of a vibe, you know? Like, you see the vibe? Like, huh? this is like, I, my goal for this was a very loungy, easy, casual look, but still looking like you tried a little um so i think i'm probably going to cut it i mean it has this little detail at the bottom so i'll lose that but i feel like it'll kind of fray on its own i just have to make sure it doesn't like fray apart <laughs> so if you have any tips on that or any ideas because i don't know if it's worth getting it tailored maybe it is let me know what you think um but i definitely need to get it um short shortened just so it's more of a crop but I really really like it I really like the color I'm gonna keep my eye out for more of these I think this could be really cute also dressed up um, and you could just kind of like wear this if you were going out at night and it was a little chillier these pants are also from Zara but they're from last summer so usually like right in the thick of summer they come out with things like this because it's kind of like a vacation type of vibe so um, just keep your eyes peeled on the side under the pants section for stuff like this. They're like loosey, loungy pants, but I really like this outfit. I'm probably gonna keep it on for the rest of the day. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, next up is this top. You know, I can't resist a white crispy top. Um, I got it in size medium. It is $39.90. And this is it basically like crisscrosses and um, goes like it has an opening in the back, like a little band. It buttons on the side. That's how it hooks. Sorry, that's the, just a little tag. But it buttons here so basically it just comes wide open and you cross it around yourself and you button it here which is kind of a pain in the ass not gonna lie also um i didn't know it did this thing so it has like buttons on the arms i'm not sure i'm not sure why what you would do with that it's very like kimono ish not sure what the goal is but i do like it i'm on the fence let me know what you think i just think it's a good um alternative for when you want a white top and again, in the summer, I wear mostly cropped tops. I just like them, I don't know. <laughs> um, I feel like it just gives me a little, adds a little length to my frame. Um, I paired these with the um, like Bermuda shorts, the long shorts. These are from my suit that I thrifted a while back. I shared it in my favorite thrift items of all times or something like that. Um, but these are basically pants I cut into shorts to kind of like try out that trend. You're seeing me style it up but um i thought this was like a cute combination because this is kind of like a fun edgier kind of top and then more tailored on the bottom i think for the price this is kind of like a fun piece i think i like it i wish it didn't have this not gonna lie um but you also i mean you don't really notice it sorry i keep looking at myself um but you also don't really notice it so let me know what you think 39 dollars. i got a medium medium fits great Okay, next up is this little <laughs> crop top shocker. Um, this one is size medium and it was also $39.90. And I really like it. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna keep it. Let me know what you think. Again, I'm trying to play around with interesting necklines and just like different styles of tops to complement my hair. Um, it has a zip here so that you can kind of get it on. And then it has like a little button in the back. Um, and it's just plain in the back, just like a plain little crop top. But I think it's super cute. It is made out of like a really nice material. Um, like it feels almost like a pair of dress pants or slacks. Um, but yeah, I really like it. I think it's well worth the price. I think it's I think it's super cute. And again, I think it would be cute with a layer on top when it's chilly. And I could dress it up or dress it down. I could put this with like a pair of like cut off shorts um, if I was just doing something really casual. 
and then I could also dress it up with like a skirt like this and some heels. Again, cost per wear um, is what I keep in mind when I'm shopping. You guys kind of saw that when we were doing the online shopping, but figuring out I need to be able to wear it at least three ways. Um, and I want everything to feel special. No matter what the price point is, like I want to love everything in my wardrobe. Even if it's basics, I want to feel great in it. So when I think about wearing it, I'm like, oh yeah, I can wear that top and I love it. Like the idea of it, not just like, eh, it's a top. So I feel like finding these more special, interesting pieces um, will kind of give me that special feeling and I love it. So, okay, I've decided I'm keeping it <laughs> throughout that conversation. Yeah, I really like it. I've sold myself on it. Okay, two other things I wanted to mention. They aren't a part of this haul, but they are still in stock. I think I like pointed them out when I was doing um, the shop with me online and I wanted to mention them because they're still in stock. And these are things I absolutely adore and I know they're gonna be sold out soon and you're gonna be asking me, where did I get it? <laughs> so you can reference this video. I just wanna say, I did my part. So <laughs> the first thing is this little off the shoulder top. It's black. I wore this in my first video after I cut my hair. And I just loved it. It made me feel so cute. It's so flattering. It's super comfy. Yeah, so I just really like it. It's lightweight. Even though it's long sleeve, it's really lightweight material. So it feels really good against the skin. And I want to say it was $39. So pretty affordable. Um, and just, again, great detail. Good little staple piece. Anytime I want to feel cute, I kind of throw that top on. And then this dress, which I talk about every time, but this is probably the best quality dress I've ever bought from Zara. It is super thick so it may like be too warm for when it's like 100 degrees um, but it's great for at night or just when it's a little chillier um, or if you're just going to be indoors like this is this will be appropriate to wear to work whenever we go back to work um, but you could also just wear it on the weekends like I wore this in LA when I went to like the vintage markets just like shopping around all day and it was so comfortable I felt so cute like I was like walking past people and they're like oh my god that outfit's so cute thanks girl but you know they didn't say it to me they were just saying it like to their friends but I heard them um but this is super cute it is a little pricey but again it is worth the money for the, the material like it feels this feels like a 400 or 500 dollar dress and I want to say it's like 69 dollars so just wanted to share that it may not be everyone's cup of tea but I just this is one of my favorite things I've gotten from Zara in a long time so and that's all guys so of course if you made it this long make sure you subscribe hit the bell notification so you never miss a video follow me on instagram at hylolux through my blog hylolux.com follow me on tiktok for daily outfit inspiration and also leave me any recommendations or suggestions for video ideas that you want to see coming up and any questions about any other outfits i think i shared all the sizes and prices but if you have other questions just let me know in the comments below as always thanks so much for stopping by see ya